hello students welcome to my youtube channel sun academy today in this lecture we are going to solve a question of preparing various types of budgets in advance accounts for ty bcom as you can see the question is a company wants to prepare its project production budget its manufactured for products opqr the sales budget for all four items is 8 lakh 9 lakh 7 lakh and 6 lakh details of stock is as follows value of opening stock is given for opqr and similarly value of closing stock is given as opening stock of o is 180 for p that is 2 lakh for q 160 and for r 140 while for uh, closing stock O 240 P 3 lakh Q 2 lakh and R 1 lakh 60 thousand and it has been said that prepare production budget for the year 2022 and 23 22 23 now we will draw production budget for 2022 23 now to find the production we need to add closing stock to the sales and from that we will subtract opening stock in this way we will come to know production to be done for each and every product now particulars here will come product units there are four products so we need to prepare four columns first product is o P, Q, R. Now, first of all, we will take sales of each product, and that is eight lakh, nine lakh, seven lakh, and six lakh. Now in that we will add a closing stock which company needs to maintain and closing stock is 240, 3 lakh, 2 lakh and 1 lakh 60,000. This will be added to the sales. So here it will be 9 lakh, here this will be 7 lakh 60,000, 9 and 3, 12 lakh and 10 lakh 40,000. In this way company needs actually to produce these units but it has already opening stock so that will be subtracted and we will come to know the real production which company has to do opening stock for o is 180 <coughs> and for p that is 2 lakh for q that is 160 and for r that is 1 40. So, subtracting these opening stock values, we will come to know required production of each and every product. <coughs> 9, for <coughs> 9 lakh, 8 lakh, 60,000. Here that will be 10 lakh. 
here this will be 8 7 40 and this will be 6 lakh 20,000 so in this way we will come to know the required production of each and every product which company needs to produce first of all you have to take sales in that you have to add closing stock from that opening stock will be subtracted and we will come to know the number of units which are to be produced now <coughs> in this chapter all questions will be different from each other so if you want to enjoy this chapter to learn this chapter actually <coughs> process of learning must be always enjoyable if you are not enjoying study then you are not or never going to learn very easily so whenever you study enjoy and if you haven't still subscribed subscribe my channel if you have subscribed and still not commenting do comment do share link of my channel